When we think celebrity, the first location to come to mind is likely Los Angeles or more specifically Hollywood. But California's cost of living increases on the daily and many famous folk would rather live elsewhere. North Carolina may not sound like an action packed state, but you might be surprised to learn a handful of celebrities have called this place home over the years and plenty of them still do. North Carolina is a state in the southeast of the United States bordered by Virginia, South Carolina, Tennessee and the Atlantic Ocean on the east. While Raleigh is the state capital, Charlotte is the largest city here and for someone who's never visited, that's also the city I've heard about the most. Now I'm not going to bore you with history and facts about North Carolina, but it's said to have a great climate, thriving job market and some of the nicest neighbors around. So there's definitely a list of reasons why celebrities choose to live here. In these videos we don't reveal any addresses and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. How's it going guys and girls? It's Kara and today we're bringing you something new here on Famous Entertainment. I know you all love the celebrity house tours we do, so we're going to count down 10 celebrities who live in North Carolina, some of whose homes you may have seen featured on this channel before. From rappers to athletes and a surprising handful of American Idol alumni, there are actually a ton of celebs that have either once called the quaint southern state home or still live there currently. If you like this series and want to see more, let me know which location you want me to do next. How about celebrities who live in Atlanta? Don't forget to like, subscribe and follow me on Instagram to chat. Now let's get into this list. We'll kick off our list with a singer we recently did a house tour on and the first American Idol alum on here, Fantasia Barrino. She is one from the show who's managed to establish a successful career in the entertainment industry and built a following of millions of fans. Fantasia was born in High Point, North Carolina and her first mansions when she made it big were located in the state as well. Actually, she once owned two in the same posh neighborhood of Piper Glen. While she no longer owns these homes as of early 2020, Fantasia still lives in Charlotte and now seems to be enjoying her time in a modern mansion that features a blue flame fireplace and marble walls. Her property also has an outdoor area that boasts a spacious front lawn overlooking a tree lined street and a backyard with pool and a covered lounge. What's up Curry crew? I've been loving all this family time that I'm getting uh, here at the household and uh, just want to give you guys a little sneak peek. Next up on our list is NBA star Steph Curry. While he currently plays for the Golden State Warriors and lives in California, he recently owned a mansion in North Carolina. He had a real estate slam dunk in 2019 when he sold his starter home in Waxhaw, North Carolina for $1.2 million. He bought the home in 2011 in a suburb next to Charlotte where he spent some time growing up. The 7,650 square foot mansion has a classic European manor vibe complete with a stone front and high ceilings. Other highlights include four beds, a home movie theater and soaring vaulted ceilings. Since Steph and his fam now spend more of their time in the Bay Area, it makes sense why he would let go of his North Carolina home. Another NBA star, well actually an NBA legend who owns some real estate in beautiful North Carolina is none other than Michael Jordan. He owns several multi-million dollar homes across the United States, two of which are in North Carolina, where the NBA team he owns, the Charlotte Hornets, is based. Michael has a lakefront home in Cornelius, North Carolina, which he purchased for $2.8 million in 2013. The mansion boasts six bedrooms, is on the Peninsula Golf Course, a luxury country club, and is 22 miles from where the Charlotte Hornets play. Michael has a second property in Charlotte too, which is the entire seventh floor of the luxurious Trust condos. This place spans about 7,000 square feet and was reportedly two units combined, each costing around $1.7 million. Hey, what's up everybody? Chris Daughter here. Like I said, a couple other American Idol stars live here or have lived in North Carolina aside from Fantasia. And if you remember Chris Daughtry, he's one of them. The rocker was born in Lasker, is a Guilford County native and formerly owns a gorgeous estate in Oak Ridge, North Carolina. He sold this property some years ago for $2.3 million, which boasted a 4,850 square foot main house with four beds, a guest house and a pool house with an apartment. Highlights of the mansion included stuff like a whole gym, insulated recording studio, saltwater pool and one acre pond. It's said that Daughtry and his family picked up a 3,463 square foot condo in Uptown Charlotte after this at the Trust Building, the same one Michael Jordan has spot. It cost Chris $1.9 million. 
So for this next North Carolina celebrity, I don't have any info on his house, but it's said that the rapper Stunna for Vegas is the next big thing out of the state. Kalik Antonio Caldwell, aka Stunna for Vegas, is a rapper and songwriter best known for his singles Animal and Up the Smoke. While he has a Vegas in his name, he's actually from Salisbury, North Carolina, and still lives there to this day. The 25 year old also has a famous friend and fellow rapper who lives here too, which I'll tell you about soon. Do you know who it is? What's going on? It's Cam Newton here, and welcome to my vlog. Back into the world of sports, another athlete who's called North Carolina home is the NFL star and former Panthers quarterback Cam Newton. After being cut loose from the team after nine seasons, he recently put his Lux condo in Charlotte up for sale at $2.9 million. While he's on his way to Boston, now this beautiful home served Cam for a handful of years, and guess what? It's also at the building the trust. The three bed, 3.5 bathroom unit offers 3,335 square feet of space and takes up half of the fifth floor. Newton's signature style is noticeable throughout, like the full size Pepsi machine decked out with his likeness. There are also shiny hardwood floors, concrete ceilings, and exposed ducts for a loft like vibe. I was one year old, and my mother knocked on that door with only a diaper bag, the clothes on our backs, and me in her arms. She needed a place to stay where she could escape from my father and start a new life. While Clay Aiken may have been runner up on season 2 of American Idol, that didn't put a damper on his busy career. Among the many notable philanthropic activities, he's also put out half a dozen albums, toured almost twice as much, starred on Broadway, and more. Clay was even the 2014 Democratic nominee in the North Carolina 2nd Congressional District election. This North Carolina celebrity is originally from Raleigh and also owned a beautiful estate in the Durham area, which he sold a few years back for $1.59 the charming mansion spans over 9,000 square feet with four beds and four baths, as well as amenities like a home theater, a games room, and a screen porch overlooking a private pond. While I'm not sure where Clay moved to from this house, I'm pretty sure he's still in North Carolina. My name is Jay Cole, Jermaine Cole, and welcome to my house. Next on our list of North Carolina celebs is another rapper, none other than J. Cole. He grew up in the city of Fayetteville and in 2020 he was seen shooting a commercial there at the basketball court near Walker Spivy Elementary School. Unfortunately, it was reported that J. Cole's childhood home was vandalized here back in 2018. It was dealt with and wasn't severe, but it must have been easy to get as fans knew the address. J. Cole's third album was named 2014 Forest Hill Drive after this Fayetteville home, a 1600 square foot house with a white picket fence out front and a pink mailbox. The album cover shows the rapper sitting on the roof. Cole has said multiple times that the home has felt like a mansion when he moved in with his mom and his brother after living in a Spring Lake trailer. These days, the intensely private rapper lives in Raleigh, North Carolina with his wife and son, but that's just about all we know. Yo. Hey. What's up, bro? Hey. This is North. Why are you in North Carolina? A few big YouTubers actually hail from North Carolina too, so next on our list is Mr. Beast. Jimmy Donaldson, better known as Mr. Beast, is a famous YouTuber and entrepreneur who is definitely one of the OGs. Over time, his content has diversified to include expensive challenge videos, donation videos involving a lot of money, and more. I even tried to make his famous Mr. Beast burger on my other channel recently. It's oozing out, but... They don't hog it. Anyways, Mr. Beast is a North Carolina native and currently resides in Greenville. While we don't know the details of his house, we did get a peek at the place when Jake Paul flew to his home and popped up at his door. I don't know about you guys, but I think Mr. Beast's house gives me pretty suburban vibes. You want me to come in? Wait, you... wait, wait, actually, before you come in, I just realized something. Oh. Uh, um, if they're gonna enter this house, I need to promote PewDiePie. Last, but definitely not least on our list of North Carolina celebrities is one of the most popular rappers right now, DaBaby, who mostly grew up in Charlotte, North Carolina. These days, he still lives there, and due to a new report, it was revealed that he has an estate in the town of Troutman, which is a small town about 40 minutes from Charlotte, and considered by most to be rural. Troutman has less than 3,000 people, 
which is why DeBaby's mansion has likely been getting a lot of attention from his neighbors and the town. Apparently, the rapper's $2.3 million estate includes wild barriers like two-story guard towers and concrete walls, and multiple Cadillac Escalades and stadium fighting in the yard. The Charlotte Ledger actually said about his home, DeBaby's compound is on a quiet, two-lane street dotted with Trump yard signs. It has certainly attracted the attention of the neighbors. It is also becoming well-known to the Troutman Code Enforcement and Police, many of whom say they have never heard of the Grammy-nominated musician from Charlotte until the complaints started pouring in. Well, it seems the baby is having fun at his North Carolina mansion, even if he's waking up neighbors in the process with the noise and the construction. I just wish we were able to see more photos of his home. All right, so that about wraps it up for our list of 10 celebrities who live in North Carolina. What did you guys think? Did you know all of these stars called the state home? Be sure to let me know in the comments or if there are any celebrities that I missed. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.